Hey guys, today I want to talk to you about PDF Element, a platform that offers fast and affordable PDF editing and conversions, providing you with all the resources that you need all in one single convenient location. So let's dive into this video explaining all the amazing features that PDF Element comes with. <music> First thing I want to talk about is editing on PDF Element and you can do tons of different features with editing on this platform but first things first is you want to go to open right here on the tools section and you can add any PDF file that you want. I'm just going to click this one for the sake of the video. So to start off there's some pretty simple features you can do with editing on a platform PDF Element. So for example if you want to add a text I'm going to put my name right here you can click any area on this page on this document to add that text. We're going to create a text box and you can put in any information you want. I'm going to put an app find right here, which is the name of our channel. And just like that, you can lengthen this if you want, or you can move it around, but I'm going to keep it right here. Now you can also add images as well. So right here on the right hand side, it's going to say select an area on a page to add an image. So if we want to add an image right here, for example, we can click that. It's going to take us to our files. So let's take a look on what image we can add to this document right here. So for example, if I want to add this document right here, I'm going to click open. And now this file is going to be shown right on the screen and my document through PDF element. I can reshape that, resize and put it anywhere on the screen that I'd like to. And it's completely up to you. So we're going to put that right here. And just like that, these are a few easy ways you can start editing your software on your document with PDF element. Now you can even add a link if you want. All you have to do is just put a link box anywhere where you feel you want to add that on this document. And then all over, over here to the right, you just press command V and add that link. And you can move this around depending on where you think it's fit on this document. It. And just like that, you can add that link, text, and photos all in this incredible platform. If we go to the markup section on PDF Element, you also can do tons of different features like highlight, cross out, underline, and do tons of certain things. So for example, you can also highlight. So if I want to highlight something, all I have to do is hover over the certain text that I want to highlight just like that. If I want to strike through something like this, I can do that instead. Tons of options to choose from. And if you want to erase any of these, you can just click that and erase any of these features that you just added to the document. You can choose the text size, the text box. You can even add sticky notes to mark certain features that you want to annotate if they're important or if you want to add in information next to a certain point on this document. So if I click sticky notes right here and go to this text right here, I can add a sticky note and I can mark this as important just like this. And now that's just also going to be available and shown when I look at this document on PDF element, just like that. And then we also have tons of other options. You can also use a paper clip. You can add a rectangular shape and you can also click to hide the comments as well. And say you're looking at a contract or some sort of agreement and you want to add your signature. You can also click this icon right here that says signature and you can also add that in this document. I can just click the signature that I already created right here. And then I can just place that at the bottom of this document or anywhere on the document that I like. like like I said, this comes in handy if you want to sign an agreement or look at a contract. And I just put that right there. And now my contract or my signature is going to be available right here at the bottom of this document, which is also a brand new and super cool feature on PDF Element. There's also this security section on PDF Element, which allows certain ways you can protect the information shared in these documents. We have redact, encrypt, and remove security. So for example, we want to click redact right here. It says redaction allows you to permanently black out and remove sensitive content. Just look that over and click OK and say you want to block something out that you feel that's sensitive content on this document, you can just hover over that text and now that'll be blocked out for protection purposes just like this. And you can click apply just like that. And it's going to ask if you want to continue and you just click OK. And now this is protected from the specific area on this document with PDF element. For more privacy features, we also have this encrypt section in the edit section right here on PDF element. And you can actually encrypt a certain document with a password. So you can create a password to get into this document. And now anyone who wants to look at this, they have to actually enter that password knowing that they have permission to enter and look at this on this document which is super cool all you have to do is just put in that password and you can look at all this information and everything looks good you just click okay but if you want to protect your data and you only want certain people to see that document and that information you share with them you can actually create a password with this encrypt section on pdf element you can essentially drag and drop your files here that you want to convert and you can choose any of these formats as you can see they have tons to choose from but for the sake of this video let's choose word right here and now let's add a file just by clicking right here add 
add files. And now let's add the one that I was previously working on just right here. And if we want to convert it to Word, you can just click apply right here. And now this PDF file is going to be converted to a Word file for you to edit and use in any way that you like. And just like that, as you'll see right here in my files on my computer, it's converted my PDF document into a Word document. And let's click it just to double check right here. It's going to open my Word app, take me to this page. And now as you'll see, it's going to be a Word document in just one moment. Just like that, you're going to see that this is now a Word file and I can activate or edit any commands right here on this document. But PDF Element can essentially convert any of your documents, your PDF files, into tons of different files. You have tons of options to choose from and that's one of the best features about this platform. Another great feature about PDF Element is its ability with OCR PDF. And essentially with this feature on PDF Element, you can convert any file that's scanned and convert that into edible text for you to use and use any way that you'd like. So this is a super cool feature. You can choose any document, it'll scan that and make it into edible text that you can use and change as you'd like. So right now I'm looking at a file to add. For example, we wanna add this one right here, we'll just click open. And as you'll notice, you can actually choose the specific language that you want this document to be translated to. We have anywhere from English, Spanish, to all these different languages you can choose from depending on your needs. You can choose how many pages you want this text recognition to go through. You can down sample it too, and you can choose if you want edible text or searchable text image. So I'm gonna keep it all like this right now and I'm allowed to perform the OCR. It's gonna take a few minutes to progress and then after it's done, it's gonna show that edible text on this file with PDF element, which is super cool. Now let's click open and view this right here. It's gonna show this menu and now it's an edible text that I can customize in any way that I like. I can edit it, mark up it in any way. I can even add security like I previously showed you in this video. So overall, with this incredibly handy and unique software, you can add notes, translate documents and create signatures with ease and you can study for classes manage documents and create incredible new text files like never before with pdf element so be sure not to miss on this amazing software and download pdf element today using the link on the screen or in the description enjoy pdf element guys